Hi friends, today we are going to see how to change the background of logon screen in Windows 7. So this is what default logon screen look, looks like. There's no background and we are going to change it. So the first thing you need to do is copy any image on your desktop which you want to set as a background of logon screen now i have selected this bag i have selected this image and make sure that the file size of this image should not be greater than 256 kb if you see the properties here i am having 196 kb size file file size so now uh, you need to find out the resolution of your desktop so right click on a computer desktop and click on screen resolution here you can see the resolution of my desktop is 1280 into 800 just remember the resolution close it and we need to set the same resolution as our desktop is having so right click on this image and open it in Microsoft Paint. Click on Resize. Uncheck this option Maintain Aspect Ratio. Click on Pixel and set the resolution 1280 into 800. Click on OK and do not save it. Click on Save as option. Give it another name. And give it the name followed by a resolution of the file that is 1280 into 800 save it on your desktop close the paint now we have two files one the background default and another one is modified background file now the next thing we need to do is we need to enter some registry values i have these registry values which i already copied all you need to do is you need to copy these values paste it in a notepad file go to the file save it save as go to the desktop save it on your desktop and give it a name as anything use custom logon screen like that but do, uh, do not forget to change the save as type to all files now after changing the save as file type and give it a name followed by the extension .reg whatever you whatever name you can you can you give give it the extension of reg click on save close the notepad file now we have this registry file on our desktop right click on the file click on merge option it will launch the user account control click on yes it will ask you to uh, it will ask you whether you are sure and you want to continue click on yes and finally click on ok now we have entered the value to the registry all you need to do is copy this both files and go to the C drive windows folder System 32 Go to this folder named OOBE And in this folder uh, there is uh, we need to go into the info folder now by default uh, This folder will not be available in Windows 7 so uh, There's no need to worry 
just click on new folder and give it a name as info it's very important that uh, you give it a name specifically as info go into info and if you don't have the info folder then uh, you will not have the background folder also so uh, once you go into info folder click on new folder and give it a name as backgrounds go into backgrounds I have this already existing background images so I'm gonna delete that and I'm gonna paste these two files it will ask you to continue and there you go close the folder now your logon background screen has been changed already so all you need to do is just hit Control alt delete button and you will be able to see the background screen now if you move if you want to move back to the default logon screen background you need to create one more registry file with the following text uh, you, by the way you can find both the registry files text in the video uh, description below this video so just copy this text paste it in a notepad file click on file click on save as save it on your desktop with the name use default logon screen or you can give it any name followed by file extension reg and change the save type again as all files click on save close the notepad file and there you go so this is for the default logon screen and this is for the custom logon screen that we have created so if you want to set the default log on screen right click on it right click on it and click on merge click on yes and click on ok so now the background will be a default one if you want to switch back again to a customer custom log on screen click on this custom registry file click on merge and click on yes and if you want to change the background again other than this all you need to do is select any image follow the procedure by setting the same resolution as your desktop is having give the same name the original file as a text uh, background default and uh, the custom file as background followed by resolution and paste it in the same folder that we have already pasted i hope you like this video please share it and give your valuable comments thank you Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to find us some more shortcut methods, please visit this YouTube channel. And don't forget to press the subscribe button.